Welcome back, guys, to Banished Mega Mod 8. My uh, voice may sound a little bit odd because I've actually been suffering from a major virus. Fortunately, I tend to record a long way ahead, so I've been able to keep videos going during this period. Now, let's have a look at where we are. We are waiting for a lot to be built in here which is fine. Um, we're having a lot of wells, we're having playgrounds, and I think that something... Oh, these are the original trees. Gosh, I hope I haven't taken those out, because I do like those trees. And I love these parts. These are part of the DS mod pack, and they're very, very pretty, aren't they? I also think they go well. I mean, we need a bit more uh, linking up here but they go very well as defining a, a sort of area when you have different paths I like it a lot we need some paths to this house obviously and in fact let's do that while we while we can do this let's go into um, gosh no nope. DS lovely uh, roads and the one we've been using, we're using a stone road, and we've been using, goodness me, this one, which is particularly nice. So let's just keep this road going to here, and then it can go into there, yeah. And I think, even though we might lose a little bit of these beautiful flowers, we need to link that road there. Then we've got roads all the way round. And we were missing a bit over here, weren't we? Yeah, just that corner. It's not much. Just speeds it up for them. Good, that's lovely. Yeah, when I have a problem with my voice, it tends to go a little bit deeper than normal, so if I'm sort of growling at you, I do apologise. Right, I think these roads look pretty good. I think we've got roads everywhere. Yeah. Oh, that will go in there. Interesting. And the entrance to the houses tend to be at the front. That's looking really nice, isn't it? Really, really nice. Okay. Now, obviously, we need a little bit of road uh, up in this direction towards the windmill. Yeah. Now, we have a barn here. No, it's a house. Fair enough. That is the butcher. And do we have road in there? I'm not sure we do. We need road, we need road. So, I think, let's see if we can get some road up. I think that's, yeah, that will go into the butchers. Oh, I can actually see the crops growing. Oh, how magical. Right, I think we'll come back to the normal road go back to our moss road because we're sort of slightly outside this area. Is that right? I think so. Right, let's take that along there. And I think we will take it to there and then down to there. That's right, let's do it that way. <clears throat> Where are they storing this flower? Oh, they're storing it in here. Right. I think they need some storage here. And that is the friendly storage, isn't it? Ah, we've got a forester's lodge finished. This is the new one we've been putting in. And I think we need to put, we've got three of four. We've got 43 laborers. So let's put in one, two, three, four. 
Let's get our foresters in there. And here, I hope that's a house. It is, I think I've been building a friendly house there. Right, that looks good. Gosh, they're a long way from anywhere, aren't they? Yeah, we need, we've got a, have we got a bridge coming there? No, these are all this. I think I was waiting until the road had been built to build a bridge. Let's go for bridges. I would like to build a covered bridge up here. Okay. Come with me. One there. One of the learning points I have learned through watching a guy called Corrales, who doesn't normally play Banished, um, but I have actually watched him play. And it's fascinating how many bridges he uses. And it improves the efficiency no end. And I was thinking that maybe I ought to... Uh, see, I've got one bridge here. But we've got a nice area here that could well do with a bridge, I think. So I think we might just have a look at the Moss Road here. Let's take that a little bit further. And then I want to just have a look at bridges. And I would like a wooden bridge, no. Small bridge, no. Let's just get, I want a tiny stone bridge, no. Stone and wood bridge, that would be nice. And they're going to build there. Yeah, I think a stone and wood bridge there would be very nice. Let's get these bridges marked as having to be built. Yeah, I think that will be a great addition. And then they're coming up here. I don't know if that's right. We, we, we may take some of these trees out and put a, another path in there. I think that's a good idea. And we need to register. Oh my goodness, this one's almost built. Yeah, that will help this person no end up here. And this one needs to be imprinted on there. We're fine for food. I'm just having a quick look at our resources. Logs have come up, actually. We're now short of stone, or we're short of something. Um, oh, pause to save. Let's come around here. Yeah, I think what we might do is take the stones out of these areas. Let's just have a look at that. Um, let's take there's, there's quite a lot of large stones here that I don't think are really adding to the community there. Yeah. I don't think these are either. I think they're right where we want the roads to go. All right. Good. Oh, this all seems to be going well. And there's a whole load of stone up here we can go and collect. Just have all that stone. That's it. Given the choice of flowers or stones. No, look at this lot, my goodness. And we will want storage and things here, so while we're at it, let's collect that. And let's put a stockpile in. And what I want it's just a general stockpile. Now, do we want it along that road? I don't think we do. I 
Let's have one. They don't need to be huge stockpiles. Let's take that one. Good. That's a lot of work for them to do. But already... And have we... Oh my goodness, we need to collect all this stone too. Goodness me. Yeah, because if we can get the labourers to collect the stone, foresters will just get on with the rest of it. Lovely. Wow. A very rocky area up here, as you would expect, deep in the hills. That should solve our stone problem if we can collect all that. Goodness me. Gosh, we will be collecting stone forevermore. Gatherers died of old age, the farmers died of old age, but they're being replaced. Pretty little covered bridge is being built. I like that a lot. Brilliant. Now, we'll wait till the bridge is built and then the road will come down here. And I think we will bend it round. Actually, it needs to go up the side of this pasture, doesn't it? Yeah, I think that's the best place for it. <clears throat> so, uh, take a road straight up there, and we will bend it. Round that corner. My goodness, we're going to be doing nothing but road building for days and days and days. We could do with an influx, couldn't we? Got another adult working as a labourer. We are 875 people, 152 students, that's good, and 134 children. Ah, a merchant has arrived. What have you brought me? Anything interesting? Always interesting. Military supplies, fancy homewares, and I think we're okay at the moment. Let's dismiss you. It's quite a, a bare area there. Are we going into winter? We are. My goodness, we've only just started. Okay, um, I'd slightly lost where we were there. Now, just to the right here, that's it. We're working on this northern area here. <clears throat> Good. Yeah, and we need storage up here. And I think the storage we need is going to be this this friendly area. So let's have a look under here. Now, is that the friendly? No, unique house, stone building. Where was the friendly area? Oh my goodness. How wonderful. Look at this. Oh my gosh, medieval grace and happiness. We'll come on to you shortly. That's the friendly area. Right, and we want storage. Does that look, yes, that does look absolutely right. I don't know what color that is, but I think we need to put this in right there. Good. Storage for the flour. And the baker is, I think, a long way from... That's the tailor. Where did I put that baker? Goodness me. Shop, 93% full. They're using that as a market, of course. Tavern. How full is that? 30%. That's not too bad. Okay. Tell me the baker's down. Yeah, the baker's right down here. That's okay. We'll see how the building of the parks comes. Um, I think that we will be able to run a road down there. And then if we've got the flower here, it's a straight run to the baker. I think that would make sense. 
from the efficiency point of view. Yeah, they, they want that road. You see how, and there's something here. There's some unevenness they don't like in the ground. Let's see what we can do. So we're going to go to the mod collections, DS, um, stone roads, there we go, and it's this one we're using, perfect, my goodness me, that's a lot of road building, oh that's a granny park, that's where it is, this isn't looking as desperately cluttered, as I thought it might. Yeah, and the woodcutter's doing a sterling job there. Look at that. Graphics wonderful, aren't they? You really can see the effort into some of it. Love it. And the fact that some of them got backpacks and things like that. I think those are the students. Well, I think we're going to be building roads forevermore at the moment. I don't think we have a chance of getting anything else sorted out. Now we've got a pasture here. That's that pasture and we've got 15 of 21. It's absolutely fine. We can close that down now. That worked splitting the other one. That's really good. Yeah, the graphics I don't think work quite so well are actually the cows, funny enough. But that's all right. Who the woodcutter was accidentally killed with an axe. Good grief. A bit unfortunate, isn't it? How do you accidentally get killed with an axe? Now, what's that waiting for building? We've got 12 builders and quite a lot going on. So let's give them what? This is a, a, actually a lovely windmill. Look at this beautiful... Um, uh, these shingles, wooden shingles, I think they are called. Beautiful. Really lovely. And I think this friendly section we found, they are very, very smart. Very cut looking. Um, I like them a lot, actually. And you don't have to use these wild colours I've used. They have these, you can see these beautiful earth colours and the reds. I think they're very, very nice indeed. So that's all good work, I think. Are we short of anything, I wonder? No, that's just building. Stockpile is just work. Stone and wood bridge is building. This one, Granny Park, is just building. Granny Park 3 is building, Gazebo is just building, everything is just building. So we're just basically waiting for the builders to catch up with what we've been doing, which is fine. Lovely. Really pretty. <clears throat> Another merchant. Oh, same one. Hello. Let's dismiss you at the moment. There's nothing I, I desperately want. Yeah, we've got bridges there. And of course, we've got bridges being built and they will build those, build those before anything. Uh, I need to go north from here. I think that looks quite good, that whole area. I like the interlinked squares. I think not having them just around one central square is really pretty. Oh, and spring has arrived very suddenly. Welcome spring. Right, okay. I think what's holding it up is this. Let's put a little bit of urgency on that. Yeah. 
because if we get the stop file done, it will make the rest of the clearance easier. Though they are clearing quite a bit. Are you producing logs? Of course you are. That's fine. And he's got stone in there. He's clearing stone as well so that he can plant all his trees. So we will have two big tree circles. The north will be our tree circles. It's a nice little area, isn't it? That comes out well. Yeah, I think these swamp barns actually do look very good in these sort of forest areas. And I think we're going to have uh, these houses substituting as lighthouses in the future. Just looking at the bridges here and whether we've got enough. I think so. Yeah, we've got another one coming up there. Nice. Yeah. Checking on... Yes, that looks to be fairly regular, that um, bridge layout. That's pretty good, I think. We've got one here. I just wonder about putting one this way here. I think I might just put in another bridge there. My goodness. Can I get a bridge across there? Probably. With a lot of merchants arriving. Let's have a look at wooden bridge, no. DS bridge, no. Small bridge, small stone bridge. If I could get one of those across there. No, it doesn't like that angle. It likes that. Let's do that. I think that's a very, ah, oh, good stockpiles been built. Yeah. And immediately clearance will be quicker. Good. Yeah. Getting the infrastructure correct. <laughs> Or at least, not correct, but efficient. Getting an efficient infrastructure. Nah. Oh, oh. No, we can't do that yet. Okay, got some merchants arriving. What have you brought me? Silver, no, I don't, at the moment I don't need any of that. You have brought me that archaeology artifacts. No, thank you. Let's get rid of you. That's another merchant gone. Oh, you're cold. Oh. Our firewood is low. I think what we need... I mean, I have everything producing firewood. I think... I am using logs uh, faster than I can produce them. That's why we put in the other forester. Um, but I do think that we... Yes, the clearance has led to some um, improvement. But we do need a log cutter. Now we've got one over here person who was cold was right here. I think maybe we get a nice little woodcutter in there. Should we have a look at that? That sounds like a, a plus. Resource production. Refined resources. Right, let's look at this. What have we got here? Celtic chopper, it's a bit small, it's a bit big. Oh, a village firewood yard sounds absolutely lovely. Yeah, that does sound good, doesn't it? Yeah, 
let's put that in there so we've got a village firewood yard to come and what is that that's a raw materials stockpile and I think we need next to it two stockpiles we will need a log stockpile in fact a log stockpile just not there there and then a fuel stockpile there let's get all this in too much for the builders yeah I've only got 25 laborers I need I've had a lot of merchants guys where's that good that's already built okay and the fuel stockpiles built and it seems ridiculous to put stockpiles in just because one house was short well, that makes sense to me though this guy needs some uh, <laughs> he needs some path is the word you're seeking for yeah that's a very boring bit isn't it I want to take those stones out and put some bushes or trees or something a bit more attractive than that this poor little house is stranded in the middle of a fairly uh, industrial area and that is a, a raw materials stockpile yeah I think maybe another one of those there would be a good idea let's have a look at that raw materials now logs fuel stone iron minerals industrial yeah I love this piece of these patches of grass let's put that in there and then let's put a tree in there to sort of soften this area a bit what should we put in meanderwood tree jasmine would be nice wedgewood jacaranda you knew I'd go for something like that yeah let's pop that in yeah put the clay stockpile in there there we go gosh you're making a lot of noise cattle such a lot of noise right guys now all we have to do is to wait for all these roads and all this infrastructure to be built and then I think we will improve our efficiency and we can move on our problem of course is people I wonder if that's going to hit us in the next episode see you in the next episode bye bye guys